Hello. Welcome to the Hard Reset. What just happened? It's the whole episode in which, you know, that doctor or, you know, so whoever they didn't like, uh-huh. they won't even, they won't even watch the whole three hour thing to show in what that, what context that they're using this snippet that they keep, you right, know, right, exactly. They're, they're basically resending out this, you know, or resharing this snippet or they, about they, they'll something see the, said. the CNN clip or the MSNBC clip or yeah. whatever it is. And then they base their opinion on it. it's like, oh, well, that guy's a hacker. Or that guy's stupid. It's like, based on what? Well, I he was. Um, They'll they, give you a they whole said, summary like, of what they think that this really? guy said. Like, did you did yeah. you watch the show? I'm not going to watch it. He's stupid. It's like, no, I tell you, what, go watch what he has to say. Yeah. You don't have to agree with it. You don't even have to. Again, um, it's that it's that context. Yeah, it's you just, know, if you there, it's it's like a self fulfilling prophecy, man. If you want something to happen. Like, in other words, if you don't want to like somebody, no, that's, gonna, that's very easy gonna, to do. You're going to find a reason to not do. to like somebody. Right. Yeah. In this case, they don't want to hear anything that remotely in this case, like the whole three hour interview where it shows his context moving up to speaking with this guy. And maybe that 15 second snippet right. at the end that everybody's using, they're repeating over and over again on CNN and all this kind of stuff. They don't want to show the five minutes before where he's like, hey. I'm, you know, you got to convince me. Yeah, that's like another one of the yeah. sayings. You got to convince me. Uh, I'm not necessarily by, or I don't necessarily agree with you. He says it like five minutes before, or like one of the things that the guy says. They never show that. No, or or they do something really crazy. Yeah. They they're like, oh man, you know what? I threw the whole kitchen sink at this. My doctor recommended this, and this helped me out, and I'm feeling great right now. And yeah. so then what they do is they, hey, you know what? He's pushing. Let's, Let's discolor yeah. his face and make it look like he's dying. Oh, it's yeah. like, are you kidding me? Oh yeah. How do you think you're going to pull that off? Because what you think nobody else saw that same feed, and then they're going to see what you put on the news mm-hmm. that does not match up. And it's like, why would you even? You should just left that alone. So all the stuff that you should be covering, you're not going to cover, but you're going to try to totally yeah. fabricate something. And it, unfortunately, it, it, yeah. defamation lawsuits are very hard to win, from what I understand. Yeah. Uh, actually, Sarah Palin, she just lost one, which again, you know what? I heard a handful of people say, why is she even on the news or and all this other stuff? It's like, well, it's a defamation lawsuit. And I understand why she went after that. Yeah. But for whatever reason, once you get this in your head that, oh, you know what? I don't like Sarah Palin. You know, I don't know much about her. There's mm-hmm. some things that she said that I dislike when she's running. Yeah. And there's some things that I thought was OK. But at the same time, it's like I'm not going to start trashing somebody because they're in the news over a lawsuit. It's like, yeah you know what? She felt like she was wrong. So let her go for it. Yeah. I, I mean, I've told you before, I, I don't dislike politicians personally. I dislike right. their, some their, of their policies, their yeah. policies on things. Yeah. And, but at the same time, I will give credit where credit is due. Like if it, again, I've not been able to find one for Joe Biden, <laughs> but if, if he's, if he does something miraculous, I will be the first one to be like, hey, did you see that he did this? This was really good. He is. Right now we're fabricating. Yeah. uh, He's going to stop the war with uh, the Ukraine. Um, That's all going to be him and his negotiations telling Putin what he needs to do. Unfortunately, I don't believe any of that. And then also on top of that, uh, he's he's beat the virus. Although the virus has already been downtrending. Other countries have already proven that it's not a thing. Yeah, Yeah, it's just kind of. But I think uh, with little, elections coming up. We're going to have up, a little COVID misinformation. Well, I don't think we're really misinforming to, things. It's kind of, yeah. if people want to, I'll put a shitload of links in this video. Yeah. Um, so people can look it up for themselves. Yeah. It's just. Well, I, again. And again, you know why? why it's, it's just entertainment anyways. That's, that's things that other people have done, like Joe Rogan or right. you know, wh- whatever that they've said. They basically will tell you, make up your own opinion. But if they don't no, like I'm, you, then they'll, they'll leave that part out. Where you said make up your own opinion. Well, so, so how do we form an opinion? So one, we need to have all the facts. We can't have. I can't base my opinion on somebody Certain else's opinion. Say they won't let facts get to. in the way of a good story. <laughs> well, <laughs> you know what I'm saying. Or in this case, their own opinion. Yeah, it's like I can't. So. You can't base. I can't base my opinion on somebody else's opinion. It's like tell me why you have that opinion and where you got it from, and let me go look at what you saw, and then I can start to form my own opinion. Maybe I dig deeper. Maybe I don't even have to dig deeper. Unfortunately, Maybe there's just a vast there. majority of the people out there that have a personal bias in that rules the day for them. Yeah, unfortunately. Yeah. I and that's sad because that's not, I don't believe that that's how the United States used to be. 
we used to like with, with, you know, fact-based uh, media and central, you know, like basically a, a neutral media, we used to be able to go back and forth and have discussions. Right. And again, now we're, now we have those, it's either hard left or hard right stuff. And no, I think, I think we need to get back to having discussions. Um, I mean, I, you know, again, I'm optimistic. I feel like, some people are getting more in the center now that we're not just because it's so it's to the point to where it's the stuff that they're saying on both ends is so ridiculous that you just can't, even if you have a biased opinion, you would like to think that you're conservative or you would like to think that you're, you know, a a liberal Mm -hmm. people are finally starting to wake up. I think a little bit and they can't quite buy into like some extreme, you know, whatever it is, you know, right. Unfortunately, you know, the guy being the nuclear, I'm sorry, I guess I don't know what, you know, oh, I didn't do you want to see, do you want to see his face again? Yeah. No, no, I can't do it. <laughs> you know, some people are not, they're, they're just getting to the point to where it's, it's gotten so extreme where they're just like, you know what? I'm pretty left leaning or whatever. And I, ju- I just can't buy into that. Like it's so again, it's yeah. a, I thought it was satire, right? <laughs> <laughs> like yeah, I literally thought it was like a an SNL sketch of like the most extreme version or no, whatever. It, it is. So p- some people they can't even even the, even being as as liberal minded as being inclusive as they possibly can just can't buy into some of the stuff because now it's the point it was so blatant. Yeah, it definitely looks like pandering. Like they are just literally. It's like they're trying to sell you a Big Mac, mm-hmm. so they're gonna t- you know they're gonna tell you everything you want to hear about how great the Big Mac is or whatever. But it's to the point to where they're like. And you can run your car on the Big Mac. Like it's, it's gotten oh, to that point to where awesome. it's gotten, it's gotten so extreme that they're, you know, they're making, they're just making stuff up right. and just to get you to buy in. And some people are waking up and being like, you know what? I really like a Big Mac, but I know you can't run a car on Big Mac or whatever. <laughs> now you've crossed the line, you know? No, but you're going to have some people says, no, you can. It's science. It's yeah. fact. I mean, and, it's kind of, and, 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 and,